Baba-baba, kagilagilalas, astounding, di ka panipaniwala, unbelievable, one syllable, baba-baba. Hi, I'm Christine. Welcome to my channel, Learn to Speak Filipino. In this video, I am going to explain why the single syllable ba turned into baba-baba which is actually a question. Alright, so referring to several videos, okay? Number one, the video about ba to ask a question which is answerable by oo, yes, or hindi, no, okay? Two videos about the um verb. Wow, baba baba. Where did the um come from? Right. Baba is a word that means to go down or to come down. Okay? It is an um verb, believe it or not. Okay? So, I have two videos about um. One is about how to form verbs with um. Okay? So, how to use the affix um to form um verbs, okay? And the other one, um, I have a separate video about the different um verbs and how they are formed, okay, in the different aspects of completion. Okay, getting back to the line, baba baba, all right? Again, it is a question, yes, it is a question. Tanong po. Okay, that is a question. So, it is asking whether perhaps the elevator is going down or coming down. However, which way you want to look at it. But baba means down. Okay, going down or coming down. Now, why did it become ba ba ba? So, first, two, two syllables. Baba is the root word. Okay, three syllables, ba, 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 is the future form. Okay, ba, ba is an um verb. Okay, when you form the past, it's bumaba. Okay, when you form the ongoing action or routine or everyday action, it is bumababa. When you form the future of um, okay, the contemplative action or the action that you're planning to do, still planning to do, you remove the um, okay? And then you repeat the first syllable of the root. If the root is baba, what is the first syllable? Um, it's still baba, right? So ba baba is will come down or will go down. So ba is a question word. Okay, or if you want to say particle because it's only one syllable, ba is used in order to ask a question answerable by yes or no. So putting together the future form of baba, which is ba baba, and the question word ba to ask if something is going down, so you it becomes ba 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 ba. Okay, so baba baba came from one single syllable ba repeated four times and it becomes now a question. Okay, so try practicing it in the elevator asking baba baba. Okay, if you would like to practice the pronunciation some more, you could refer to my previous videos about pronoun pronouncing uh, difficult words or hard to pronounce words in Filipino. On that note, salamat Jimmy for that question. Okay, I hope I was able to answer your question. What is the meaning of baba baba? Maraming salamat for watching. Maraming salamat for listening. Until the next video.